All right, what's up, Happy Clam Guy? And what's up, yeah, what's up, everybody else? <laughs> you can tell I'm saucy as fuck, and guess what? I don't give a shit. Even when I'm saucy, I'm cool. Now, here's what's going to happen. Happy Clam Guy gave me a list of 10 people. And I'm going to go through... I know you're right. I'm backpacking videos. And you never want to do that. Right? Except I do. And here... Let me tell you why. Because I just achieved 1.99. <laughs> I finally got under the bar, bros. That's where I want to be. That's where I want to be. And I'm sure it wasn't none of y'all. No, it was, it was some of y'all. More of y'all need to fucking quit. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> quit the game, nigga. You don't, you, you don't play the game correctly. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to take Happy Clam Guy's um, list. He gave me a list of 10. And I'm going to go through them one video at a time. So this video is going to be the first guy on his list. Now, this is a guy named Plotinus. Now, the, the problem with, with this guy is, is that he, he tends to get mashed into... Okay, because... Uh, all right, look. <laughs> There's a philosophy called Platonism. And that would be the philosophy of Plato. And then there's a philosophy called Neoplatonism, which is the philosophy of Plotinus. And so all the PLs start getting confusing to people. Right? Let me tell you what the, the, the idea, the, the ultimate idea here is. Is that if you wanted to say that somebody made a a genuine like foolproof philosophical argument for unity in divinity it wasn't plato it was plotinus which is actually why this is this is where a lot of the fucking catholic teachings and everything come from they come from what was called neoplatonism which is goofy because they're confusing the the plts <laughs> you know what I mean? Without the vowels. It's kind of like the Yahweh and Jehovah shit. It's like if you don't have the vowels and the consonants right, you're not going to understand anything. So what do I think of this guy? Well, he, he's basically, he's a monist. He's somebody that, ah, yeah, you know, kind of thinks everything is of one taste or one flavor. And And that's, and here's my problem with it. It's not defined. It's not defined. Sorry. God, why the fuck do I always get the hiccups and the burps of this? At the same time, it's goofy, man. But the idea that... Look, we get the fact that, that there is a unity to reality. We all get this. Now, what that unity is, I mean, it's been called the ground of being. It's been called so many things amongst different cultures, everything. I don't think you're breaking ground, Plotinus. I don't think he's breaking ground. What, what I think he's doing is, is he's basically saying that everything else doesn't really fucking matter. Like, metaphysically, that's the only thing that matters. So... How highly do I hold this guy? Not very highly. I, I don't. I don't really think like. I, I think that there were some people that did it a lot better, that came earlier. When you talk about the pre-Socratics, like your your you know, uh, what what was his name again? Parmenides, and Heraclitus, and 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 these folks. You know because, <clears throat> correct me if I'm wrong. And seriously, ham, uh, ham guy. I'm gonna call you ham guy from now on because I'm just, yeah, I'm, I'm sauced out. But who gives a fuck, man? We're having fun with this video. Correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't par and, and look, dude, this is not a computer. I'm not, I'm not googling shit. <laughs> my phone is. Oh wait, it's in my hand. <laughs> I don't have anything else. 
Correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't Parmenides, wasn't he the one that argued for, you know, the impossibility of motion because of his concept of the one? I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, because, I, you know, when I, we get back to these ancient thinkers, it just, just like you have to fucking like think the way their, their minds worked. And sometimes like I'm OK, so you got team Heraclitus and you got team Parmenides. I'm team Heraclitus all day long. I think being is flux. Whereas Parmenides was being is immutable. Now, see, the way I read, uh, who was the guy you said again? Oh, Plotinus. I see him as being more in the, uh, the category that I disagree with. But that's just because, well, we'll get into this when we, we start talking about like other figures. But I just really, the whole concept of unifying the pl platonic forms into the form of the one and then ultimately the Christians would use that to buttress their concept of God. No. I'm sorry. I just I it was cool for its time. It had to stay in the sun. I mean, really. <laughs> I'm reminded of so many songs right now. I'm in a musical mood. So as soon as I turn this video off, I'm I'm putting a playlist on. I don't know, is my music playlist video playlist is that visible to people I, I have no idea but it's the awesomest playlist ever you should turn on it's like 23 hours long it's so fucking awesome but no seriously um i don't think that he was that revolutionary at all i wouldn't put him in my top 50 <laughs> philosophers to be honest with you i understand like at, at a time Okay, so influential means two different things. So it could mean influential to history, and I think it was very influential to history because this is what the, you know, Augustine and the early church, that's what they picked up. But I think that was an accident of history. They could have picked up anything else. That was just like, that's what they had because <laughs> the rest of the books were burned by God knows who, right? So it is what it is, but, you know, I don't really hold that guy... It, it, to be as a philosopher to be that high of a standard i mean okay you understand monism okay cool monism now what are you gonna do with it um well nothing anywho <laughs> dude mr clam guy i'm gonna be going through all of your fucking list one by one and i'm the last three i don't even know who the fuck they they fucking are man i'll figure it out though I'll, you know, I have the Google. <laughs> Doesn't mean I'll understand this shit like perfectly. I've never read any of their books or anything. It, it seems like made up names. I thought you were trolling me in a second there, but maybe you're not. I don't know. I haven't looked any of them up, but I will when we get to them. I don't know who's next on the list, but trust me, we'll get to it. Holy fuck. Two videos in one day for one guy. And they're both going to be, but I, I achieved 1.99, which means that when I do shit like this, when I backpack videos, that means that one video gets buried under the other video in the backpack. You don't understand how YouTube works. Anywho, thanks, man. Thanks for helping me achieve my goal. <laughs>